Alright, so do you want to have a castle game like this? Well, it's a game on castle making play. Want to have a game like this? Where you tap the button and then you get a shop. More multiplier. Boom, 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 boom. More multiplier. Boom, 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 boom. More multiplier. You want that? Cool. <laughs> That's exactly what I got. Alright, the mic better be working. No, I'm serious this time. I have tried this like 10 times. And the mic was not working in any of them. So now, what you're gonna wanna do is get a new deck. Blank. <sighs> Layout. Change background color. And then basically... New empty... Blueprint. Red. Red circle. Yep. Just like that. <laughs> uh, fill in the red. Fill in the red. That's layer one. But then you're going to want to want to do good. In. Let's get the drawing. Then make it's um, layer two. Make one the exact size, which apparently doesn't seem to be working. Okay, there we go. <laughs> and then, I don't want to move this to right there. And then, click on layer one, dot, dot, dot. Click move up. So now you got yourself a button. Click add. And then basically, you're going to want to... Um, for layer one, well, it's layer two now, but layer one, it's called layer one. It's up, though. Um, you're gonna move it so it looks like the button's upside down. And then for layer two, on animation frame two, you're gonna wanna erase it. So now, when you press it, um, when we add the script, it's gonna look like you're pushing a button. Yay. Yay. And then, basically... Click on rules. Click on rules. Um, when a touch beginning, when a touch begins on this, um, modify a property. Select property. Um, current frame to two. No, not three. Two. And when. Touch ends on this. Modify a property. Current frame. One to one. Now, one. One. And then basically, what you're gonna wanna do, and they're gonna wanna do, um, gonna wanna go to that little settings up there. Add new variable. Add new variable. Another one, yes. First variable, it's going to be called taps. Um, persistent. And both are persistent. And then the other one's going to be called multiplier. How neat. Right, yeah. Multiplier's value is 1, taps is 0. And then what you're going to want to do is basically go to empty blueprint when all right when a touch begins on this um go to modify the value of a variable variable a deck variable taps press the little potion thing um the value of a variable deck multiplier so now when you tap it it's gonna Oh, and relative, of course. I don't know why you wouldn't choose relative. No. <laughs> but now you're going to want to take that button and take that button and make it bigger and try to center it as much as possible. I don't care if it's not centered, all right? Oh, yeah, I forgot. The, um, the art, the hit boxes. What just... 
Yeah, I don't know what in the world just happened. Hitboxes. Make that hitbox bigger. Um, then, well, I'm going to move it the full week down. I'm going to move it down. And basically, what you're going to want to do, and you're going to want to circumstance. Um, go up here. That. Make it that font or whatever font you want, honestly. Make it white or whatever color you want. Um, do taps, colon, no, not X, money sign, taps. Hey, it's my cat, it's my kitty cat. Er, taps. This one's gonna be capital, of course. And then, right here is gonna be zero obviously because you haven't tapped the button yet why would you expect it to be a number if you have not tapped the button yet it's the whole the weekend point all right so now when you tap it when you press it whatever you want to call it um it's gonna make a bigger number like like this so yeah save then, um, oh, yeah, then what you're going to want to do, and they're going to want a circumstance, you're going to want to, you're going to want to, no, not a diamond, text, not no diamond, stupid, um, Basically, color it green. Um, same font as before. Shop. I don't care if it shows up brown. Look, I swear, if you see it's green, I chose green, so it's going to be green. It listens to me. Ha ha. Skill issue. Um, <laughs> skill issue. So, yeah, there's a shop button. And I'm going to want to, um,. Rules when this is tapped. Send player to a different card. And I'm not going to choose that card right yet. Because it's not there. <laughs> Add a new card. And then lay out the same background color. Please. Please the same background color. Because if I'm playing this game, I, I, I want it to be neat. So, yeah, same background color. And basically, you're going to want to gonna do is add, well, first, um, all the last 10 tries, um, I made a back button first. Which, I'm probably going to have to split it into two parts, so it's... Short enough for TikTok, which, yes, I get it. It's a 10-minute um, video, um, but you can upload 10-minute videos to TikTok now. Or, well, you've been able to do that. So, yeah. Oh my God, I can't get it right. This is why I hate triangles. I just don't like them. No. No. Oh, that's actually, yes, I'm in, yes. <laughs> and then, basically, it's not going to be off-center because I don't feel like it. It's not going to be off-center. All right, it's not off-center. Please. Okay, good. Logic rules. Come back in part two because it's better be over ten minutes. That. <laughs>